Going on to you to side coverage now, Donald Trump is the presumptive Republican nominee. His last remaining rival, John Kasich, officially dropping out just a few minutes ago. I can tell you that economic growth can be achieved by our public officials if they just do their job. But they have to ignore polls. They can't focus on focus groups. And they have to overcome the fear of re-election or criticism. Ted Cruz, as you probably know, ended his run last night. That leaves Trump with a clear path to the nomination and a likely showdown with Hillary Clinton. Now, for Wisconsin Republicans, the news somewhat stunning. Remember, only four weeks ago, Cruz won big here. Trump was on the defensive. Our political reporter, Theo Keith, says now they're deciding whether to support Trump. Theo. Brad, Governor Walker was subdued today and gave a less than convincing endorsement of Trump. Walker says he has to support Trump because of something he said nine months ago. That was the time that turned the tightest election. The Serb Hall stage in Milwaukee was the turning point, just not in the way Ted Cruz and Scott Walker expected. Donald Trump reeled off seven straight wins. Cruz and John Kasich are out. Wednesday, without enthusiasm, Walker said he's going to support Trump. I think Donald Trump is clearly better than Hillary Clinton. Uh, for a variety of reasons. When asked to name them, Walker said taxes, regulations, and who each would nominate to the Supreme Court. Walker is following through on a promise made at the first Republican debate last summer when the candidates vowed to support the eventual nominee. What am I going to do? Am I going to say he's doing a great job? He's not doing a great job. Even though Trump blasted Walker in Wisconsin. And the bottom line is that he said that before, some of that stuff before the Wisconsin primary and the people who know best. Uh, didn't buy into that. Other Republicans are not yet on board the Trump train. State Senator Dewey Strobel led Cruz's efforts in Wisconsin. I certainly need to go a long way to be sold on this candidate. I guess he needs to change the way he's behaved his prior 70 years. Assembly Leader Jim Steinecke, part of the Never Trump movement, isn't sure what he'll do. Now there's the camp support Hillary Clinton and um, you know, for me, Donald Trump just hasn't, he hasn't gotten to the point where he's earned my vote. So we'll, we'll see what the next several months bring. Even Walker did not commit to campaigning with Trump in Wisconsin. Trump trails Clinton in national polls and here in the state. Some Republicans tell me they are concerned that Trump will end up being a drag on down candidates. Brett.